So what I'm about to say may be controversial, but at the same time, it's actually true. So my family are friends with a lot of truck drivers, and I mean semi-truck drivers. And we were told in no short order that in six months' time, there is going to be a gas shortage, or at least a diesel shortage, which is going to cause essentially a lot of logistical problems for the future. One of those being, of course, food shortages. So in six months' time, I'd recommend everyone start preparing. Now, of course, this could be alleviated in six months. A lot of things can happen in six months. Uh, like the war in Ukraine could be stopped. You know, we could essentially have, you know, reached peace, hopefully enough. Hopefully. Um, Biden could be impeached. Hopefully. Uh, the gas problems could be solved. Hopefully. But in six months' time, things are going to get a lot worse. So, to those of you out there who are preppers, I'd recommend you start actually kind of being prepared for all hell breaking loose. Uh, for those of you out there who are in the city, uh, I'd recommend you get the hell out. Um, come to Tennessee, come to the countryside, buy a farm, start growing your own food. For those of you out there who are in the airsoft community, be ready, because all those games we play, everything that we do, everything we've learned in this sport, we may be using those skills for real. And to everyone else out there, I say this. Pray, pray that within six months' time, the gas problem changes. Pray within six months' time that everything doesn't go to shit. And as always, ladies and gentlemen, I've been Airsoft Al. And my life just... <laughs> oh, God. I am starting to see why Heath Ledger's Joker was right. And I can only pray that we don't go any worse than we already are. At the same time, though, if society does break down, at least we will hopefully create a libertarian utopia, like Starship Troopers. Oh, who am I kidding? It's going to be fucking Fallout. We know it's going to be Fallout, which means my ass is going to New Vegas. Because, let's face it, the Mojave is probably going to be the most stable out of any of the states that fall into anarchy. We all know this.